hello everyone welcome to the channel in this video guys i'm going to show you and troubleshoot you how you can fix the issue if screen hid driver is not available on your device manager so you're not able to use your touch screen so how to fix the issue guys so i have already opened the device manager let me show you how you can open it i'm, I'm going to show you in windows 10 and 11 i have two devices here this is my windows 10 laptop and this is my windows 11 laptop let me show you okay if i open device manager in both the devices in windows 10 and 11 this is my dell laptop and this is my lenovo laptop let me show you this one is my touch screen and the second one doesn't have so let me show you how what is the difference okay so first of all open the device manager and once you open the device manager you need to go to the human interface devices it means that the HID drivers expand that and inside here you need to look for guys this driver HID complaint touch screen so you don't have this driver that's why you search it but let me show you how you can get it back you need to click on this human interface devices okay and go to action and scan for hardware changes so once you search the scan for hardware changes check if you are able to see the this driver touch screen driver if still not click on your host name computer host name then click on view then show hidden devices once you click on show hidden devices check if it is disabled if like this is disabled guys let me disable it for you okay if it is disabled like this touch, touch, touch screen is not going to work as you can see here I'm going to touch my laptop but not working if I enable that okay I let me touch it now see it is working I'm touching with my fingers you can see here without cursor and all okay so this is the first way to troubleshoot this issue if it is disabled that you have to enable that option and let me show you in windows this device as well so again go to same options and you can see i don't have any hid screen driver here uh, let me show since i don't have the hardware in this case if I click on this option you can see here HID complaint touch screen driver is here but try to update it once if that is not working guys just right click and update browse click on this option and choose the same option or the latest one then hit next option and click on close once you have closed this it will reinstall the same driver or the latest driver or even you can roll back the driver here how to roll back it driver then click on roll back driver okay choose the any option after that click on ok but in my laptop this option is not supported so you need to make sure that your device has the hardware in order to work that you can go to the manufacturer website and check all the specification configuration of your laptop and check it should be touch screen if it is so you can next let's move on to the next step guys you can also update a driver as I have already shown you and open the simply cmd as admin mode and hit us yes option when the prompt opens and type this command guys simply sf c space forward slash scan now this will scan the integrity as well as the windows corruption and it will fix your issue if this option is not working go ahead and look for the update on your windows 
sometime if windows is not updated you can get this issue as well so check for update and if you are able to view the drivers here let me show in windows 11 as well okay check for update also and look for the view optional update and sometime the updated driver may be listed there and make sure your window is up to date also you can run the troubleshooter some of them other troubleshooter in windows in general go to other troubleshooter instead of additional troubleshooter hit the windows update sometime windows corruption first of all hit this option then hover up to this option program compatibility this option and run it this will automatically detect your issue and try to resolve your issue if these options are not working guys we can go to the manufacturer website and check for the screen driver there but it should not be listed there but we can at least try that Dell driver enter the serial number here let me open the CMD hit this command WMIC product CS product this is the identifier number serial number copy and paste that by selecting and paste it here some of the driver you can download from there first of all you need to download the BIOS driver that is very important part this one in any laptop BIOS driver and then hit for the this option graphic driver okay hit this driver and the third one driver is chipset driver software that is very helpful in order to work the hardware and software so hit these th three drivers here guys and let me see if we are able to check for the driver no okay hit download these three drivers here plug in the charger restart your system and i'm pretty sure after applying these methods your issue will be fixed so i hope guys your issue is fixed now also wait for the hundred percent to complete restart the system and your issue should fix so thank you thanks for watching